Greetings from the Erie Coast. This is Mad Shad. Tier Vigi May Tier Bless on this wonderful Tuesday, rainy Tuesday, cold Tuesday. That's why I'm in Zoot. Yes. Uh, I got my frog togs on. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Frog togs. Frog togs. You gotta, you gotta like frog togs. I, I, I think I paid a little bit too much for this thing. But it does do the job. It's 40, uh, 40 bucks for uh, frog togs. Anyway, uh, enough about my jacket. Uh, it, it, it stops the rain, but it's not a good ra uh, wind windbreaker. Let's just say that. Uh, <laughs> when it gets wet, the wind has a tendency to cool as it flows through. It's kind of airy. It, it does breathe. But anyway, uh, enough about my damn jacket. Uh, you know, uh, it's, it's Tuesday, and it's a pretty good day. Pretty good day. Not bad, not bad. I'll tell you about those who had a uh, pretty damn bad day. Uh, those Americans that are trapped in Afghanistan left there by Trader Joe's militia slash incompetent regime. And at least we forget that 13 servicemen and women died at Abigail, Kabul, Afghanistan, along with 200 other poor souls. 300 plus people lost arms and legs and limbs. Things that don't grow back. A lot of them were service members as well. Every day, never forget, and never forget whose fault this is. Deployed I fans. <laughs> but there was hope. Folks getting him out. Task Force Argo, Task Force Pineapple, Project Exodus, Project Dynamo, Christian Coalition, Mighty Oak Foundation, just to name a few. Uh, it's uh, They're still in country, by the way. Uh, there is a humanitarian crisis going on in, in the uh, Af Afghanistan. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, there shouldn't be any, any more uh, uh, Americans in Afghanistan. But if they are, it's because of their own free will. You know, they're working or something. Right or, or other, but uh, but this did happen. This did happen. So uh, I keep saying it. I keep, keep every day, every fucking day. At least we forget that 200 plus people are still incarcerated over the J6 debacle, held there as political prisoners without bail, without sentencing, and they're arresting more under uh, uh, very, very bad conditions. They're being tortured. Yes, they're being fucking tortured. Uh, somebody lost an eye. People are getting beat up. Uh, solitary confinement. No food. No water. Bad wa bad food. Bad water. Uh, you know, beatings. Uh, yeah, yeah. Interrogations. Constant interrogations. Uh, you know, they're given a deal. Uh, that They're offered a deal that if they turn... If they are willing to uh, go to uh, testify against Trump, then they are giving uh, given either special treatment, uh, favorable treatment, reduced sentences, reduced sentences, or set free. Yeah, but you know what? In defiance, every morning they call their loved ones and they sing at the top of their lungs the national anthem. Oh, say can you see? By the dawn's early light. You remember that song? Yeah. Um, yeah, they sing that every morning. Every fucking morning. All of them. Every day, never forget. And never forget whose fault this is. But there's hope. There is hope. Uh... Thousands of people, family, friends, loved ones, charitable organizations, uh, law firms doing pro bono work, uh, charitable organizations sending uh, care packages to the incarcerated and to the displaced families. There's a lot of moms and dads in prison. Uh, so, And uh, there's there's senators, congressmen, representatives doing doing work. Uh, you know, uh, Mr. Uh, Speaker of the House uh, has, has release footage he had you know about 89 tapes uh they they vow to release all of them but at the rate they're going this it's just gonna fucking they're just dragging their fucking feet uh you know whatever at least it's something uh but you know they are having uh committee hearings and and all this bullshit uh you know the the uh the superintendent of of prisons was was uh, on the on the stand on the the house uh, hearing stand and she you know whatever did her thing you know uh, her milk toast uh, testimony but there's so many more so many more uh, and yeah so uh, this is against a tyrannical regime that 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 cares not. For all this mess, uh, but you know, hey, uh, there there is still hope, right? So, uh, meanwhile, 
meanwhile, it's it's whatever. Uh, meanwhile, life goes on. Life goes on. Oh, uh, Sheets. Uh, it's a store here uh, in in Ohio. I don't know where else it is. It could be elsewhere in the uh, country. But they're 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 they're, they're going to offer their unleaded 88, which is like a mixed blend of gasoline and ethanol. Uh, for a dollar ninety nine a gallon, so if you have your if if you uh, if your car is able to use unleaded eighty eight, which my car is not, uh, then you can uh, participate in the dollar ninety nine gallon uh, fill up. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, pretty cool. Uh, see, I had some other things in other news. Um, uh, let's see. Oh, uh, yeah. This was brought to my attention by, uh, uh, my friend, uh, Fed Up, Fed Up American down south, uh, in, in, uh, in Ohio that a, a mass shooter shot up a Walmart, shot like four people, um, and then was quickly killed. I, I don't know how he was killed. Uh, I think he killed, yeah, he killed himself. Uh, so... I, uh, I can't stress it to you enough that obviously, uh, you know, things like this are going to happen because they want to push for more and more and more uh, gun control, right? Uh, gun control, yes. Uh, and so it's a... Uh, and you're going to see a lot more crime, more people, more, more desperate people out there... <clears throat> And they're doing desperate things, and that that means they're going to be more violent. So I can't stress this enough. Carry a gun, just carry a gun. I I don't care where you are, whatever. Carry a gun. Oh, it's illegal. No, no, it's not. No, no. Uh, you know the Second Amendment says it's it's okay. <laughs> we, the people, say it's okay. Uh, so you know, protect yourself protect yourself and your and your family and your loved ones you know uh, I, I can imagine I can only I can only imagine you know the horror of a family going to going to Walmart to shop and here comes this guy walking in the door with a fucking gun and you know, start shooting people you know and then nobody has a gun there's no uh, there's no heroes everybody's a victim don't be a victim. You're American, damn it. <laughs> anyway, uh, don't get me started. Fuck, I'm already started. Anyway, yes, protect yourself at all times. Carry. Carry. And get training. Or, you know what? Just go down a back road. Get, get yourself a, 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 a case of beer. Drink it. Throw it at the hillside and shoot them. <laughs> shoot the empty beer cans. I mean, that's that that's how I learned when I was a young age, you know? <laughs> some old some old cadres took me out there and said, "Oh, shoot that there can, boy." Oh yeah, huh? I bet 20 bucks you can't do it. Yeah, you know. Do that shit. Do that shit and, and take your family out and shoot it, you know? Uh you don't have to get drunk while you do it, but hey, you know, uh so it happens, right? Uh <laughs> I tell the story of this, uh, uh, anyway, no, I'm not going to tell that story, uh, but anyway, <laughs> uh, another, another thing to mention, let's see, uh, oh yes, uh, Ohio has, uh, is, is passing, they're going to pass this, it's passing, it's in the house, it's going up to their, uh, uh, state senate and everything, it's going to pass, uh, Ohio is going to be a sanctuary, a two-way sanctuary city, uh, two-way sanctuary state. Cities, uh, well, you know, they've already said, hey, you can't, you can't uh, stop people from, you know, what's legal in the city, in a state. You just can't. There's no city ordinances that says that you have, you have to, you know, do all these background checks and you're, you're restricted. No, it's, it's bullshit, uh, you know, and fight it, fight it and carry, you know. If the state says we can carry, fucking carry. We already have constitutional carry. Right, so I, I can carry, you know, open carry. I can conceal carry. I don't need a permit, and that's that's many many states are doing that. Uh, my 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 uh, my home state Tennessee is doing it. Uh, so do that, 
do that. Take advantage of that. Because you have to protect you, your family, and your loved ones. You know? And listen to this now. This is very, very important. This is very serious. If you're going to carry, you have to be able to, right there, when you decide to carry, you've decided to take a life. All right? That's, that's, that's for real. That's, you have decided to protect yourself. You have decided to join the club of, of Americans that, that wish to protect ourselves from uh, tyranny. Tyranny and, and cr criminal activity is tyranny, right? So, you know, just put your... Can, can, eh, yeah, I can't say the words. You, you, you have to make that decision. You have to say, well, I'm carrying. That means I will possibly take a life. And you have to be okay with that. You have to be okay with that. So, uh, go Team Linda. Go Team Linda. Fuck cancer. She is kicking ass, taking names, getting stronger by the day. Go Team Baby Harper. Go Team Baby Harper. I can only assume the best as well that uh, Team Baby Harper is uh, getting better and getting stronger by the day. Go Team Christy. Team Christy is recovering uh, and getting stronger by the day. Go Team uh, Mrs. Tomcat. Go Team Mrs. Tomcat. She as well uh, is getting stronger by the day. Um, so this has been Mad Shad. Every day, never forget.